any national strategy has to be rooted in a strong maritime strategy. And in order to have a strong maritime strategy, you have to have a strong Navy, all right? And that all ties back to Aegis. In order to defend the aircraft carrier against threats, uh, the Aegis system does that and does it very well. And now that, that same shield is now expanded to protect uh, other points of interest, both at sea and ashore. If you're not continuing to evolve and keeping up with the threats from the adversaries, then you're no longer relevant. You need to be able to do that to you know, maintain our preeminence at sea. And, and if we do not do that, then our interests are threatened, particularly today in a global economy. And you go back in time and you look at significant surface combatants uh, that did not receive a combat system modernization, usually are decommissioned at the 17-year point. And that seems to be a horrible waste of the taxpayers' money to throw away these ships halfway through their service life. So it's important in order to keep the ships relevant and the surface Navy relevant to continue to modernize these ships with uh, advanced uh, combat system capabilities.